What's up everyone, it's Q from Retro Q Gaming, and I am finally happy to announce, to myself at least anyway, that Tales of Zestiria finally has a release date for outside of Japan. So it launched earlier this year in Japan, it's the latest game in the Tales series, if you exclude the, the brand new, just announced one from a few days ago. But this one... I'm really looking forward to it because, like all the games, it's going to revamp the combat system a bit. Well, depending on a bit, but um, the thing that makes us really happy is uh, there's two or three versions, or two or three reasons, if you will. So originally, when it launched earlier this year in Japan on the PS3, that was the only version announced. Although there was like a partial leak, if you will. Um, I made a video of it before about how... Tales of Zestiria was spotted for the Steam database. Now, like I said in the previous video, appearing in the Steam database doesn't necessarily mean it will release on Steam because people have seen Destiny and Halo 3 both on the Steam database, obviously both of which have no PC version. But what is nice about this is in Europe, I'm just going for Europe here because you know I, I live here so uh the ps3 and p and now ps4 version will arrive on october 16th which makes me very happy a little bit of a long wait but very happy and a pc version will launch on steam on october 20th now i'll probably buy the ps4 version myself we'll see maybe maybe i'll get the the pc version instead who knows but at the moment, it could be the P just the, the PS4 version. I was originally looking forward to it on the PS3, mainly because most of the Tales games have had a system where it would recognize your save data and give you like new costumes or something. So the fact that I have a bunch of them on PS3 already finished, you know, it might have done something. But with the graphics and performance improvements, um, I'll take those on PS4 or possibly PC. We'll see how it goes anyway. So that's really nice. Um, one other thing that's that's quick to, to announce as well, if you will, is that the PS4 and PC versions are European and North American exclusives. So, I mean, the game is already out in Japan for a few months now, only on PS3, but they will not be getting the PS4 or PC version. I, could, I can understand them not getting the PC version because PC gaming isn't really huge over there. But the PS4 version, the fact that they're not getting it, kind of surprises me a little but even even if i do go for the ps4 version and if many people go for the ps4 version it's nice to see it finally getting released on steam on the pc as well because steam really need or the pc in general really needs a a big boost to jrpgs and we've had an influx of jrpgs just in general lately and just some other japanese games that i wouldn't really count as rpgs but it's nice to see steam users and pc users finally getting some love in that respect and it it's it, it paints a slightly po promising future that more publishers and more developers will bring their games their jrpgs or just japanese games that usually get released on console in general to the pc either at some point in the future after release or you know release simultaneously or very shortly after in the case of of uh tales of Zestiria because it's it's going to come out like four days after on the pc so it, it's it, it's nice to see anyway and what i'm also kind of happy to see about is like i said in my previous video at a convention in dublin last november caitlin glass confirmed that she was in tales of zestiria so i'm i'm curious to see, to hear that she couldn't she wasn't allowed to say who it was or who she voiced in it but i'll most likely be able to tell straight away anyway so <laughs> we'll um, i'm curious to see all, all that so let me know in the comment section below what platform you're going to get it on if you're happy that it is being ported to ps4 and pc i know like i said already i am because this officially retires my ps3 for ps3 games i was only holding out for this and persona 5 persona 5 got announced for ps4 so yay or and um now this is ps4 and pc so yay so ps3 is just kind of retired i'm getting off on a, on a my own little thing here so let me know in the comment section below that what you plan on getting it on if this will be your first tales game if you love the tales games 
just anything like that in general. So let me know all that down below. Hit the like button. Hit the subscribe button. You can follow me on Twitter. Details in the description below. Thank you for watching, and I will see you on the rest of the videos in my channel.